Uh, you know, you may know Norm McDonald from his time on SNL. You might know him from being in Billy Madison. Uh, what you may not know, which I think is actually kind of sneaky, is that he's also Canadian. Uh, and he's also going to be performing at the Wilbur tonight in what I'm being told is being billed as the comic performance of the decade, no pressure. But enough about Norm. Josh, no. uh, you <laughs> are op you're opening for Norm. I am. Tell me a little bit about that well, experience. Well, I'm, I'm a folky... Um, no, I'm a folk musician. I come out with my guitar, and I like to... You know, He's a folk singer, but folks don't care much for his singing. <laughs> Are you going to take that, Josh? Well, I guess we you want have the to people agree. to find out that for themselves tonight at 7.30 and 10 at the Wilbur Theater. Just like Fox, we report, you decide. So you yes. perform, they decide. Yes. All right, that's fair. Um, I don't like those networks where it's, uh, I decide, you report. <laughs> and then you're at home, you're like, I have to report? Yeah. You have to go out and do a story? Too, too much reporter involved. Yeah, a little too like, much what? Where do I have to go to a fire? <laughs> now, did, you guys, uh, did you guys have Sloppy Joe's last night? I, I understand that was the big, uh, where'd you go? Well, to the, inter, the inter, uh, intermission. You want to save him here, Norm? Yeah. The Anytime inter you want to jump in. I forget, yeah. it was a very sloppy... Um, a fair, no, I spilled it all over myself. But I came, I wanted to come to Boston because I heard the beans were excellent. Have you sampled the beans? In Boston? Yeah. No. Okay. But listen, this is, this is a beautiful town, and we went to the Boston Commons yesterday and saw the folks. You, you, know? were, you were afraid of the folks, though. You didn't want to do this. Oh, yeah, no, I, yeah, I'm frightened of people. And when they collect together in a park, I'm scared of them. So, <laughs> okay. so you try to avoid situations like that. Yeah. Tell me a little bit about uh, the stand-up that uh, that you're performing tonight at the Wilbur. Well, I'm I'm doing just jokes about uh, I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm talking I'm talk about. <laughs> Poli the politics. No, I don't talk about politics. All right, good. Because I don't know anything about it. You do know a thing or two about death, though. I'm Canadian. <laughs> you are Canadian. You know what's interesting about being Canadian? You. <coughs> Like, you know, in America, they go, America's number one, you yeah. know what I mean? But it's a sort of a case to be made for that. But in Canada, they're like, Canada, we're number one. You're like, what? <laughs> yes. Like, how's that possible? It's like, it's, it's morally offensive to yeah, the American Well, yeah, fabric. we're maybe like top 430 or something. I would be careful, though, because we do we do broadcast in Prince Edward Island, so. Oh, no, I'm Canadian. I'm just saying it's, it's so inconsequential. Like, here, the elections, it's like, if one guy wants to go to war, the other guy has a bomb. And then in Canada, it's like, uh, what do you, what's the, what do you, what's the big issue? And it's like, are they going to build that bridge? <laughs> so you can go for either guy. Not, nothing real bad's going to happen. I imagine you ice fish then. No, I never ice no, fish. No. Okay. Well, I, no, one time I did. I caught a, I, I caught a bucket of ice. <laughs> <laughs> How does that eat? Doesn't last very long on the grill, nah, I imagine. No. Uh, I do want to mention, uh, because Gene insisted upon it, and several people actually, guys, this morning, as I was saying that I was going to be interviewing you, were all excited about the fact that uh, death was going to be on the Fox 25 morning news. People love you for that, for oh, being yeah, on yeah. Family Guy. Family Guy, yeah. I just did it one time in a room. Okay. You go into a room, and then uh, you, you, there's the cartoon there, and you just talk so that your voice matches the cartoon. <laughs> the cartoon's mouth? Yeah. Gotcha, gotcha. It takes a lot of sinking, I imagine. It's There's a lot easiest, of time. It's a delicate well, it's process. It's the easiest thing ever <laughs> that's ever existed as a job. Well, I tell you what. Talking while watching a cartoon. <laughs> <laughs> what is not an easy job is doing stand-up, although you do it well. Josh? It's pretty easy. I imagine you do it well, too. Well, otherwise, you wouldn't be opening for Norm. I'm just, I'm getting back in. You know what's it. hard work? Varmint control. <laughs> You know what, let's talk about that more in the commercial break. But for the moment, uh, tonight, two shows at the Wilbur, 7.30 and 10 p.m. You can buy tickets at thewilbur.com. We'll